Hey, what's going on everyone? Void Fox here, and I'm taking an early first look at Forsaken Isle. It's an action survival game with exploring, crafting, building, uh, and fighting, uh, all within a randomly generated map. Okay, so you're on this, uh, I guess you're stranded on this island. And uh, this is going to be my first go at it. Punch some sheep? No, <laughs> you can't punch some sheep. Oh, you can punch, you got some seaweed, you can punch rocks. Some shells. Can I chop down trees with my fists? No, I can't punch trees. Can't punch, uh... What are these things? Oh, punch some sticks, some flowers. We're gonna see how all this, uh, comes together. After we can craft some of this stuff. Nice! I love the artwork! So charming! We got all kinds of stuff here. Is there a way to quick add it to my inventory? No, there's not. That'd be a first suggestion of mine, unless there's a way and I'm just, I don't know how to do it. A way to quickly add things uh, to your to your pouch. Oh, uh, these are all resources, as told by the subtext, a placeable grain. So I guess you can create farms and stuff. That's kind of cool. All right, so over here is where you craft, it looks like. We add some flint, uh, fibers. Oh, look at that. A bandage and a cord. Uh, what if we add a stick? Chisel. I wonder what that's for. Chiseling, I suppose. I guess we'll make a hammer. I don't exactly know what that's going to do. I will make a cord. And let's add the cord to... Oh! Okay, so cord's like a... Ties things up. See that? Yep. Sword. Look at that. Flint shovel, flint axe, flint spear. So it looks like flint is sort of a uh, key starting resource. So we have a weapon, a tool. Uh, well, let's get the flint axe. You know we're going to be chopping stuff down. Alright, let's check out the axe. I wonder if I can also attack things with it. Oh, yes, I can. I just rocked. <laughs> I just rocked that snake. Okay, what do we got here? More fibers. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm po- This isn't a very good weapon. But we're going to go ahead and try to kill him anyway. Don't shoot me! Oh my god, I'm poisoned again! There, I got him. He didn't drop any loot. Damn you. Choppy choppy. Oh, damn. Some resin, coconuts, carrot seeds. Alright, so let's see what we can do now. So we have some resin. We have a coconut. Oh. Coconut. Split coconut and you get two hunger on its own. It's just a placeable. So we might as well... There we go. So now we got some food. Ooh, a bowstring. Resin and a cord. A, uh, a workbench. Used to craft basic items. Let's make one of those. So it looks like you're always, uh, you're also trying to manage your hunger. Right here, we have a hunger meter. Uh, I'm not sure what this is. Maybe stamina when you're fighting and health. Uh, so let's let's go ahead and place this down and see what it does. A basket, a four-slot container, wooden sword. Uh, we're gonna need a weapon. So let's go find some flint. Uh, can I take this with me? Yes, I can. We'll find some flint, and we'll, um... Damn, it's dark. We'll make a weapon. Alright, so flint, some sticks. I think that's what made, uh, the spear. There we go. Attack 2, speed 4. Oh boy. Ah! Raw meat! Alright, so it looks like we can probably cook that too. Gotta figure out how to build a fire. There's these uh, things here. If I right click, oh, there's an underground. Mm, I need a uh, probably a pickaxe. I'm assuming. Very cool. I'm really liking this game. I like how the crafting sy system is. It's very simple. Basically, you just <laughs> sort of throw things together, and it will show you if anything can be made from from what you've thrown in there. Let's check out down here. See what this is all about. This is here. Some roots. Oh, a skeleton or something. Come on, skeleton. You're nothing. I'm stuck there. I can't go through there because there's a rock. I wonder if you can actually mine through those rocks if you had like a pickaxe or something. I'm going to see if I can get him to... Oh, damn. He hit for 10? No joke, eh? Now, we came down over here. If we go up here... Yeah, so you, you actually come up on different... That's cool. You come up on different uh, areas of the map. So you can go down underground uh, different areas of the map. That's pretty sweet. 
It's just chicken. Come here, chicken! Got a feather. Oh, for arrows? I think? I think so. That was just a bird. Can I capture it? Oh my god, just kill everything. That's not nice at all. Wow, he took off. I wonder if you can build nets and stuff. I bet you there's so much to discover in this game. Uh, those interested, the game is in early access. I probably should have started with that. But the game is in early access and available on Steam. I have a link to it in the description below. I'll, I'll talk more about that at the end of the video. Oh, hey, there we go. Four sticks and flint will make a campfire. Right-click on the fire. Aha, look at that. There we go. Bingo. How much hunger? 12 hunger. Beautiful. 14 hunger. Let's go ahead and eat that. Boom. Eat this beautiful chicken. The whole chicken. This guy can eat a lot. Holy shit. Okay, yeah. So cooking things in general is better. Let's see what happens if you put wool in the fire. Nothing. It burns. Oh, mushroom. Hell yeah, grill that mushroom. This game's a lot of fun. I can I can really see getting lost for hours uh, trying to discover all the recipes and, and things you can do and craft. Uh, I, oh, is that a carrot? That looks like a carrot in the ground by the pig there. Go check it out. Chop, chop. Yep, carrot. Carrot seeds. Okay, got my spear ready. Let's go down. Oh, a chest. Yeah. You just hit it. Right click. Oh, right click. Ring, oh, accessories, ring of energy, three energy regen. Okay. Here, oh, there we go. So we have two wearables and looks like a, I don't know what that's all about, iron ore. Oh, shit. Some torches. Fire arrow. This is ammo down here, I believe, yeah. And rope. Can be, can be used to move up a level? Huh. Interesting. Oh, look at that. I can carry the torch, too, if I want. <laughs> Do I hit things with it? Yeah, nice. Cool. Ooh, a slime. Come into the light, so I can see you. Nice. The spear's got a bit of knockback, so keeping you, I think, fairly safe. Doesn't look like enemies drop loot. Or if they do, it's it's rare. Okay, so now that I know there's a there's treasure chest down here, let's see if we can find more. Drop bones. I got a lot of bones now. Oh, you can make a skull. Ooh, let's make one. Oh, a chest. Beautiful. Let's see what's inside. Ooh, six light. I have a feeling. I got a feeling that that light is um emanates around me. Let's find out. Yep. See that? That's cool. That's very cool. And hungry. See some of these mushrooms. Num num num. Those work quite well. There's no. That's what the rope was for, right? Let's try that. Let's try one of the ropes. Yep. There you go. It brought me up. <laughs> it didn't make a hole though. I don't know if that actually matters. Oh, skeletons. So they're not just underground. Unless they just come out at night above ground. I guess that would kind of make sense. I don't think there's a map. Maybe maybe create landmarks, right? Like like drop things down. This will be Skull Island. There you go, Skull Island. <laughs> oh, what's this? Ooh, all kinds of stuff. Right here, we're gonna establish ourselves. We're gonna put down the workbench. Flint hoe, yeah, there it is. Flint hoe. All right, let's make that there. And uh. Yeah, there you go. Beautiful. This is where our garden's gonna be. Our beautiful garden. Oh, oh my god, my OCD in me is, I have to have this perfect. There. That'll that'll be it. We're going to plant some carrot seeds. Nice. And some grain. Let's do this in rows, folks. Come on. Some grain. And we have some orange seeds. Nice. There we go. Oh, a worm. <laughs> cool. Get a bunch of material. See if we can build uh, some fence. Some fences. Stick fence. <laughs> I don't know what's what's better. I'm assuming uh, just fence. I don't know if it matters. But let's go ahead and just get a bunch of fences here. 
Oh yeah, there we go. Fences. Can I hold right click? Ah. Uh, all right, fine. Why can't? Because there's flowers. Everything about this game is so charming. I have to admit, I really like it. I mean, it's so simple, right? You know, the animations are simple but effective. The art style is is freaking awesome. I'm not hearing any music though. I don't know if there is any music in this game. Uh, I would like to see a way of organizing the inventory, like, uh, you know, like, uh, separate spaces for materials, for food, you know, for tools, things like that, or an auto sort. That'd be very cool. You can dig up the bush. <laughs> very bush, it's placeable, so you can place it somewhere else. Okay, I guess that can be useful. All right, if you want your, uh... You know, your berry bushes go up in the corner here, maybe, for example. Maybe I can have a whole row. <gasps> That's a good idea. Let's do that. They're growing into beautiful little oranges. Okay. We're starting to get a nice little cozy home here. This is kind of cool. You can kind of, you know, do different things with this game. You can go out hunting. You can go gathering. You can craft. Uh, you can go underground and do some, some uh, you know, exploring. See if you can find... Uh, treasures, stone maybe, or iron ore, no, do we have stone, rocks, here we go, a mason block, nice, there's chisel, hammer, rocks, cool, let's see what that does, whoops, go, aha, so, what does this do, I wonder, okay, gravel, stone block is a resource, and sharp stone is a resource, there we go. Now we can make stone axes. Probably last longer than flint. Okay, I see where this is going. We got tiered system here. Let me get hungry again. Okay, we got a bunch of uh nom nom nom. <laughs> just ramp rampage eating. Okay, well let's just make a, a flint pickaxe for now. Just so we have something. Uh let's go down and see how this works. Maybe we can get some materials. There's this blue crystal thing over here. Yep, that works. Raw sapphire. Okay, so I actually want to... Do I have a placeable? Maybe a torch. We'll put a torch here. Mark it. There we go. So I know that's the way up. Iron ore. All right. More sapphire. This is iron, right? Oh, copper. Nice. Yeah, the axe is... Or the spear is good because it doesn't knock them back too far and it allows you to get a few hits in. Probably should be laying these down like a trail, right? I know how to get back. Oh god, bat! Oh my god, these skills! Yeah, what's up? I can just charge them? <laughs> charge! Wolfhood, two melee damage. That's what this must be for. Ha! Cool. Oh nice, he actually wears it! <laughs> oh, look at that. It does four damage now. That's just awesome. Awesome. Oh, this game's awesome. Love it. Loving it. Oh, yeah, I do so much more damage. Oh, my God. I'm so, uh, so lost. <laughs> Let's just pop my head up here for a second. Skull Island! <laughs> I'm south of here. It worked. Landmarks for the win. <laughs> Look at my crops. Beautiful. Okay, that blinking flower's got to go. OCD. This is a lot of fun. That's really all I can say. It's a lot of fun. I think it's visually charming. Uh, there's a lot to do currently in this version of Early Access. Uh, I don't feel like I've even scratched the surface of finding all the recipes that exist. There's probably hundreds. Crafting is very simple. It's got this discovery... Uh, throw everything in there to see what you can make. And if you guys are interested in seeing more of this, let me know in the comments below. Thank you very much. This has been Void Fox. Uh, taking an early look at Forsaken Isle. Check it out. It's awesome. It's a lot of fun. Thanks for tuning in. Later.